Hey everybody, welcome back to another Static Cast Gaming video. Today is Monday, December 21st, 2020. I hope everyone had a great day today. Today I just wanted to talk about my experience with these console drops. Um, you know, there was a couple of them, so let's go ahead and get right to it. Uh, first, when I woke up this morning, I saw a notification from Twitter that uh, Target did finally go live with PS5, and it looks like also Xbox Series X and S. Um, now, I didn't even try to get up and wait for this because I had no idea what they were doing. And I, I, frankly, I didn't care at this point. Um, so I just stayed asleep. And when I woke up, I saw all this. Um, at this point, I figure that most of these sites, when I go to them, they're just going to crash or they're not going to let me add it to the cart anyway uh, because of all the traffic that's getting there. So, But let me know if you got through. I'd love to hear your experience. Um, the next one, I think, was Best Buy, somewhere close to around 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I did go ahead and try that. Um, you know, when I got to their site, I noticed that they had a description up this time that basically instructed us to wait for that uh, please wait button to turn yellow and say add to cart, you know, at which point, at that point, we would uh, add it to cart and try to check out as quickly as possible. Um, also, I noticed when I clicked that little message away, it said, you know, get it today nearby, and then it says, pickup order now for pickup on Saturday December 26th um, so obviously that's not today nearby that's the 26th nearby but it said availability today at location you know at location that was 14 miles away from me so I didn't know what to make of that but I thought maybe I stood a chance this time so I kind of you know got hopeful for a second there um, and eventually that please wait turn to add to cart I got a checkout button, but when I hit the checkout button, I get this beautiful message. Sorry, PlayStation 5 console is no longer available for pickup at the store you selected. Sorry about that. You still might be able to get it if you check nearby stores for availability. So once again, I have to go into the, the list of stores at the top without Best Buy helping me out and letting me know who has the actual stock. I basically chose every store and I got the same message and eventually I got, you know, store pickup is not available within 250 miles. And, you know, by the way, I did check this on the app as well, the Best Buy app, and I got this same exact thing there as well. So, you know, at this point, I am so frustrated with Best Buy. I, I you know, I just, they, they're not going to have any stock in my area. What's the point? So Best Buy, you stink and I'm done with you. Um, besides that, I think Ann Online put this up on Twitter. They said, we will have small quantities of PS5 available throughout the week due to order cancellations, etc. In an effort to get any remaining PS5s out to our followers ASAP, we will list them as they become available. We won't be posting these officially here, but check our site often. And I think they did end up going live, actually, later on, not long after that, but I, again, I think I did try to at least go to the site, but by the time I got there, it just said out of stock. Um, I think it, it just spun around, I guess, from the traffic, and eventually it said out of stock, so I didn't really stand a chance there, as usual. So, you know, at this point, you know, let me know what happened to you in the comments. You know, I'd love to hear everybody's experiences. You know, I'm sure there might have been a few people here and there that were able to get through with these console drops today. Unfortunately for me and probably most people, you know, it was an impossibility, unfortunately, and it just seems like that's what's going on. So the only thing I could say is that, you know, I'm trying not to let it get to me too much. Um, you know, if I have to wait to get one, then I'll just have to wait in the next year to get one. Um, you know, I'm fortunate that I do have an Xbox Series X, so I'll just try to enjoy that until I can finally get a PS5. But uh, let me know in the comments what you think about all this and what your experiences were. I'd love to hear it. And stay tuned for more videos. Have a good one.